Ah, uh, catchy. Can't do anything with Sojuro. <sighs> Saturday, but, uh... I don't... Hi. Yeah, I won't be able to talk to her until I do the, um... A kindness movie, charm movie. I'm gonna raise my charm. Uh, Saturday night. Yeah, actually, I'll just add this. Crap. Unfortunately, because all those cutscenes went, uh, I couldn't go into mementos. So I won't be able to do to do anything with Kawakami till next week, which really sucks. That's what I did. In the case, is the leader of a criminal in Shibuya. Many people were surprised that the criminal suddenly arrested. People are also reasserting their stance that the Phantom Thieves weren't involved in the arrest. There were some outlets are reporting otherwise. Well, it's true, we weren't involved in the arrest. He turned himself in. hang out with Akechi, or actually, uh, the fortune teller. Um, we can unlock the fortune teller. I can't tell you how to <sighs> Crossroads. Oh, honey. Wait, why can this increase my kindness? That's rough. I want to work part-time hey. here, okay. Teach the basics of how things are run here. Don't worry, you won't do, you do anything illegal. Work at the bar will cost time to pass. Addition of receiving money, all kindness will improve. Uh, there will still be days when the bar is crowded. Striking up conversations with very customers may improve your kindness as well as other social stats, depending on who you talk to. Hmm. I mean, so you want to do some work for me today? Uh, I will pass on it today. Um, you take care. I want now. to unlock the. Uh, So actually, two questions here. She's here. The other one is not. Okay, let's unlock the fortune teller while we're here oh, and we have money. Is that the lie about it as people lose faith in them being able to do their job without outside assistance? Well, I mean, strictly speaking, Phantom Thieves did not have anything to do with the arrest. The calling card was posted. He turned himself in to the police and admitted everything. And he has no knowledge of the Phantom Thieves being involved and was not mentioning it. So... Strictly speaking, they are correct because they don't know of any involvement. Uh, hey, is that the fortune teller everybody talks about? You're gonna get your fortune read. Yes, I am. Hello, please take a seat. Hello. First time here, yes? It's not often that I get a young, young man, that I get young men stopping by my stand. Anyway, my name is Chihaya Mafune. I'll be reading your fortune today. Um, Begin by telling me your name. Didn't you already know it? I suppose I could attempt to divine it if you'd like. Let's just begin with your last name. Is it Yamamoto or maybe Ishima or perhaps Red? Hmm. This may take longer than expected. Ah, I see, I see your name is quite lucky. I decide what type of consultation can I interest you in today. Uh, give me the full package. Well, I suppose life of a high schooler is difficult after all. Now then, let's start with initial reading, test the waters of your fate. Oh, yeah. divine power, bring forth the voice fortune. First card is, hmm, I see, as for the second, oh, next is... Is this? Yes, I've seen everything, a stream of light obscuring the sun like an arrow tearing through the sky. Here it is. See, this seems to be new wealth in your future. Your financial fortune is looking good today. The wealth which I speak will come from your house. At home without the tour, and you'll recite, and precisely 5,000 yen will be awaiting you there. I'll do just that. Yes. As you should. Fate is absolute. Um. What is this? 
So strange, the general flow of your future seems to indicate ruin. And an inmate locked away in a lonely cell? You seem to be a good person, right? Are you perhaps mixed up with the wrong crowd? Mm -hmm. Beyond that, my it seems continuing your current path will lead to your death. Be ridiculous. You act confident, but remember, fate is absolute. That's impossible. Yeah, this divination is coming to me clearly. The truth is simply undeniable. Although, now I think about it, there may be a way you can attempt to counteract your destiny. Buy my expensive rock. Mm -hmm. All you need is my special spiritual object, the Holy Stone. With its power in your control, you can avoid even the most unfortunate futures, probably. I typically only recommend this to my most experienced customers, but your situation is too dire to ignore. You see, the stone itself is imbued with an aura of joy that will sap away all the horrible energies surrounding you. All you need to do is keep it wrapped in cloth and be sure to recharge its power in moonlight every three days. Well, what do you say? That's the cost. It's only 100,000 yen. Not bad for an item that could change your future, yes? Seems suspicious. It's legitimate, I swear. Well, you really don't want it? So? What a shame. It, it'll, it will be to see the flames of youth snuffed out so soon. Well, come see me again if you change your mind. I really, I really can help you if you'd like. Back. Oh, you're home. I've been waiting for you. Oh. You seem strangely happy. I wonder what's going on. Uh, pocket, how's your pocket money situation been looking? <laughs> you're hopeless. Fine. Here. For real? Is that 5,000 yen? I won some money from the lotto, so I don't mind sharing my winnings. That's rude. Thanks. Yeah, I can be nice sometimes. The rest is on you. Anyway, make sure you close up the shop like always. Hey. Does this mean the fortune teller was right? This is kind of scary. That's incredible. Even got the amount spot on. Maybe the Chihaya lady can seriously read the future. Wait, is this bad? This is bad. Didn't she say you're going to die? Come on, we need to talk to her again and figure out what to do. Maybe I can have her read my compatibility fortune with. No. Uh, never mind. Maybe I should go back and have her read my fortune again. And there's a holy stone too. She said it cost 100,000 yen. Uh, 95,000 yen, I think you mean. Oh yeah, we all know what, uh, Morgana's. We all know who Morgana's. Who we had for. Don't be ridiculous! This new ally you gained was Makoto? Just tell me the truth! You already know the truth. Makoto... That's preposterous! If what you say is true... Was Makoto also running from the police when you were arrested? Ask her yourself. Now that I think about it... She did start talking a lot about the investigation from summer onward. <sighs> Makoto aside, you mentioned one other important detail. Did Kanashiro really say there was someone using the metaverse besides the Phantom Thieves? Oh good, you are listening. Those words could just be taken as you shifting blame to this other person, you know. Take it how you will. <laughs> But why would you fabricate such an elaborate story and then shift the blame elsewhere? There are two possibilities. Either you've simply been trying to confuse me with your lies, or everything you've stated is true. Have you been telling me the truth from the very start? I'm pretty sure I'm hopped up on truth serum, and I can't lie right now. Of course. Does that mean you're placing your trust in me? Then again, I am investigating a thief who steals hearts. Very well. No matter how absurd it may seem, I'll reevaluate my stance on believing you, for now. In return, speak the whole truth and nothing but the truth. It's a fair deal. Is that acceptable? Made a deal with Sai and Ichiba. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Judgment Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Judgment. 
judge rank one. All right. We're running out of time. Let's move on to your next target. Actually, I should rephrase that. They targeted your group first, didn't they? The identity of your opponent is this. We have no pictures. Even their names and identities are unknown. If what you told me is true, then this nav thing you've mentioned wouldn't have worked in this case. How did you target them? Tell me everything. From an arc perspective, this one is my favorite section. And has one of my favorite characters. Yeah, we're slowly going up. 35%. You're up there, right? Come on downstairs. Uh, you gotta make me work today, Sojiro. Yeah, he's totally gonna make me work. in the fridge. Hey, what's up? Huh? It's not right? Not cute. That was the one the staff recommended to me, though. Won't that printer do? Huh? It'll do, but it's not it. Okay, I'll be right over. Printer that has to be cute. <sighs> this might take a while. I'm leaving the store to you. Lock up for me if I don't come back. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Let me tell you exactly how the fights win in Mementos. Uh, going on a date? Something like that. <laughs> what a handful. And that concludes the latest news on the suspect Kaneshiro. This case is said to be a result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but what do you think? We don't know their methods, but I believe they are a menace that will threaten this law-abiding country. This dangerous group tampers with people's hearts. It's no different from brainwashing. I see. You're absolutely correct. I wonder what's going on. Didn't this happen a little while ago, too? Who was it again? You know, that famous artist. Ah, Adorame. Adorame, was it? They punished those awful people, didn't they? The Phantom Thieves aren't at fault, then. Well, that may be true, but... Don't you think so, too, dearie? The Phantom Thieves aren't doing anything wrong, are they? Probably not. Well, I think they're doing good. Thank oh, you. I, look at the time. We should probably... You should get a smartphone and vote in the poll. You're right. Thanks I can for the help drink. you with the smartphone if you vote in the poll for me. Yes, I've received the reports on Kaneshiro's case. But to think the Phantom Thieves would honestly attempt an absurd idea like social reform. Uh, you're absolutely right. I'm not pleased about the general public support of them either. There's also the danger of the metaverse being exposed with their continued actions. Actually, there is one countermeasure he brought in that seems usable. It involves having the Phantom Thieves destroy themselves without our direct intervention. We'll set things up so that those mental shutdown occurrences are their doing. Ah, I thought as much. I had a feeling that it was too brutal for it to be his own idea. Still think you'd go through such elaborate detail to crush them. Their actions must be that much of an eyesore for you. I sympathize with what you're going through. Well then, we'll clean this up quickly and put it behind us. Yes, a grand undertaking like social reform is beyond a group such as the Phantom Thieves.
Only a select few are worthy of changing the world. And who better than the future Prime Minister, sir? You're being cautious on the damn telephone, but not in the middle of a bustling area where you just start shouting. That's not why we're here. We need to study for finals. No, we don't. Why am I here, too? You're one of us now, so of course you gotta help us. We're in trouble if you don't teach us, you know. I don't... I don't wanna... I don't wanna... Hey, Yusuke is here for the moral support. Also, you know, it's like he's also a student. He probably has some sort of finals as well. I don't need to study. Oh, I'll hold you to that. Want to see who gets the higher test scores? Let's leave those guys be. <sighs> I couldn't ask the last time I was here, but what is this place? The storekeeper doesn't seem to be around. Nope. It's you where do this stuff guy lives. Losing. He's got complicated circumstances. We can tell her about it, right? Actually, tell yourself. Way to go, Ryuji. Just out me. That's... That's terrible. On Yusuke and me are pretty much the same, too. I mean, <laughs> it's not as bad as this guy's, though. It's just something we can't ever put up with. That's why we all became Phantom Thieves. Hey, don't forget me. I know, I know. We're all part of the team. By the way, Makoto, ain't there someone you can't forgive either? Like, a heart you want to change? That's a secret. Ah, oh, there's someone like that. You could just tell us, you know. You don't gotta be so cold. That aside, do you have any intention of studying for the exams? Ryuji does not. not really. <laughs> it's fine if I leave then? No, no, I I'm just joking. Please teach us. Hmm. What was this term? It's phobia, so it's a fear of some kind. I think it's a fear of open spaces. You don't hear it that often, though. Leave vocabulary and long sentences to me. I suck at proper grammar, though. Yep. Ugh, even if we study English, it's not like I'm going to use it in the future. I am totally with on on that one. It's like, I feel like uh, vocabulary and stuff, I'm just terrible at spelling and punctuation. When it comes to you, your Japanese is questionable too. Uh, shut up! Explain the writer's feelings? What point is there in that? Oh, it's impossible. I can't memorize all these formulas. Ain't there a good way of cheating? <sighs> Why don't we take a break? And that was the follow-up report on the suspect Kaneshiro. Now, Akechi-san. Akechi. This case is said to be the result of the Phantom Thieves' actions, but in actuality, is this true? Considering how a calling card was scattered about, I believe there's no mistaking that. The question is what the Phantom Thieves actually did. If they tampered with the suspect's heart, it casts doubt on the authenticity of any confession. So then, by tampering with hearts, the Phantom Thieves are fabricating crimes that may not exist? We can't deny the possibility. There's no doubt that the Phantom Thieves are exposing hidden injustices in society. However, if this is done by sidestepping the law, their way of thinking is very dangerous. So, in a way, they're outlaws? Yes. They're no different than the criminals they target. This cannot be overlooked. I see. Oh, I see. My ass. Why the hell are we being treated as the bad guys? Just let them say whatever they want. More people are starting to understand that what we're doing is right, after all. When I'm walking around in town, I hear a lot more people talking about us, too. And the forum's been full of hype. Do you think we made it big time? Don't get pompous over dealing with some street thug. 
Save it for after we deal with a bigger target. We just gotta take down a bigger one, yeah? That was the plan from the start anyways. True. It may be best if we start thinking about it. I bet we'll find one in no time. Wind's blowing in our direction and everything. I feel like we won't lose to anything right now. Well, we'll decide on that eventually. We need to overcome our exams first. Now then, break time's over. Let's get back to... That reminds me! The celebration party! Weren't we gonna do it after exams? Yes, I believe so. Where should we go? I feel like I'll study better if I got something to look forward to. The last one was a buffet at a hotel. We haven't gone anywhere since. Hmm? A buffet? Hmm, where would be good? Hey, what about fireworks? A fireworks festival! Oh yeah, it's that season, huh? <laughs> that sounds good to me. It's hard to ignore a buffet, but... I'll take the beauties of summer. Still, I demand that we feast during the festival as well. Do you guys own a yukata? Will you wear a yukata? Doesn't a fireworks festival sound good? I, you think so too, right? It's a great idea. Yusuke is trying to make uh, up for his lost time. Festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. All right, fireworks festival it is. Let's look for a good one. Study comes first, though. I won't let you off if you fail any of them. Are we clear? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Hmm. Fireworks and Yukatas, guess it's that time of year. Hey, so this dangerous, almost psychotic blog I found that hasn't ended up on any farm yet. I'll kill him, I'll kill him, I'll kill him. That's all it says. Rumor has it she's stalking, she's talking about her boyfriend. Oh, it's stalker chick. Sounds dangerous. Yeah, it seems like she'll do something really bad someday, right? And it gets even worse. It turns out she's a student, student you know, a girl named... Miko Mogami, she's always up near the classroom on the second floor. Yeah, stalker chick. Please do something before she thinks get worse. Take some time to talk about it at the hideout. Love sick cyber stalking girl. Yep. Nice. Ah, uh, it's healthy for now, huh? I'll just add this. Two more, Donna. But all the sales. Okay. Uh, so I can study. I am out of decent books. I have a proficiency DVD, I believe. Oh. Yeah, proficiency. Uh. Do studying actually, because uh, for Makoto I need to be one more rank up, and I need. As for the burger challenge, I need guts and. Let me just pull up the stats. For the burger challenge, I need guts and knowledge. For the doctor, I need charm, and for the gun shop owner, I need guts. So I can't do guts or charm tonight. So let's work on knowledge. Listen up. What do you want to do? Make sure you close up. All right, head now. Hey, hey. Let's solve these problems really quickly. I hope you're not just picking the easy ones. You're making some good progress. <laughs> hey, encyclopedic knowledge rank up. Alright. Boom, baby. Well then. Tire yourself out if you keep this up for too long. 
to get some sleep. So, cool, we're good on Makoto then. Um, yeah, Charm. I wonder what the Phantom Thieves' goal is. Are they just choosing bad people to steal hearts from? Uh, maybe something, somebody, someone's asking them to do it. Oh yeah, don't they have a forum or something? What if you make a request on there and they follow through? What a refreshing morning. How are you doing? I didn't expect the Phantom Thieves would suppress a man that even the police had trouble with. The fact they have so much support online is worrisome. I'm in a bind since I previously denounced them. All the interviews these days ask me about that. Still, can we really say the Phantom Thieves are on the side of justice with just this example? You mean I was originally investigating the mental shutdown incidents. People change suddenly and cause strange accidents or horrible crimes. Don't you think it's similar to the change of heart that the Phantom Thieves are doing? Hmm. Now that I think about it, their actions mirror the mental shutdown cases with the rate of victims. It's impossible not to see a connection there. Ah, sorry. I don't want to make you late. I'll see you again. All right, Mr. Avengers. packed than usual today. Today's trade news. Shibuya Crime Ring reveals all. Weir's confession led to the arrest of other key members. Sudden rampage. Highway accident. The driver's death has been confirmed. Taking the total count up to four. Hot spots of Tokyo. Come see the summer fireworks show on July 18th. Okay. I see. Shira's spilling the beans. That organization is falling like a house of cards. Uh, we won't be get it. We're getting more and more famous. Okay, let's get started. Hey, Marky. Oh, you're relying on others, but I can't recommend it. That really messes up your information retention. Oh, speaking of, do you guys know the difference between short-term and long-term memory? The answer is simple, is that short-term memory is more temporary, contextually, but long-term memory stick with you. In the short term, you're working with a hard limit. You retain only six, maybe seven pieces of information. Uh, and that's actually really fun. You can test yourself on that uh, with like how many pieces of information you can retain at once. Um, because if you take like, say like, uh, like a combination or something, right? It's like say one, seven, five, four, two, six, whatever, you know, it's like, you can see how many numbers you can remember. Um, then try changing it into dates like 1974, 1800. And you can see that the number of things you can remember matches up, even though there's more information in the years because it's a bundle of information, you can hold on to it. So it's a fun little uh, mental exercise. But your brain's capacity for long-term memory is huge. Might even be infinite, according to some theories. That one not infinite. Oh, okay, Red, what do you think about all this? Short-term memories only stick with you for seconds at a time. That said, how long do you think you can retain long-term memories? It's not how long you can long-term memories, huh? This is a tricky one. What is a long-term memory, anyway? Uh, Memories of your whole life? That's long term memory anyway. Memories that last a long time. Anyway, you keep them for a long time, the question is how long? Rookie mentioned something about the amount of memories you could store, right? Something like infinite. If you have theoretically infinite space for them, theoretically you'd be able to retain them for forever. Nice. This is it. That's right. Basically, stuff encoded into your long-term memory never really goes away. Short-term memories become long-term memories through reiteration. It'd be great if you could encode all the test answers to long-term memory, huh? Oh well, we can't always get what we want. 